And what is that? Morning. All stunts performed in this video were conducted by trained professionals in a safe, controlled environment. Super safe. Do not try this at home. What's good, YouTube? Welcome back to another video, man. And today we have another rating my subscriber straps video, man. So if you guys want to be featured in one of these videos, all you have to do is DM me on Instagram at Eastside Givens. Send me pictures and videos of your straps. Make sure you type in there. Tell me what your strap is, what upgrades you did to it, attachments, whatever the case may be. Or you guys can join my Discord server. The link will be in the description. Um, the Discord is Guap Gang. We have a channel where you can send pictures of all your straps on there and talk to me. Whoop de whoop. So join the Discord server or DM me on Instagram if you guys want to be featured in one of these videos. Without further or do, further or do, further or do. I don't even know what I'm talking about. Let's get into this video, man. So first up, my boy got the 19X. You can never go wrong with the Glock 19X. So let me tell y'all, this um, 43X is what I EDC mostly during the day, you feel what I'm saying? Great carry, but you know, when I go to bed, this is what I got next to me on that nightstand. The 19X with that old light, flashlight, and the beam. So this is my nighttime home defense firearm. I love this thing. Sometimes I will EDC it outside the crib as well, but that 43X is just so small and subcompact. It's a great EDC, but 19X is as well. He has the old light. Uh, I'm not sure which one is on there, but I did put the Bald R Mini on my 19X, and that's just what I prefer because you know it aligns with the barrel and it fits nice and aligned everything smooth but um that light works as well he does have the uh extended magazine so it's not like he just trying to keep it tactical because you feel what i'm saying this is something i could edc inside the waistband and you know conceal carry that's not so you might as well just go ahead and slap that long o light on there the whole sleeve um me personally, bro, I had the tan hoax sleeve. I don't really like the black on the 19X, but you feel me? You got the black on the magazine and the light too, so it kind of black and brown go together a little bit. But I would recommend getting the tan sleeve. Mine's somewhere over there. Y'all seen it before. I used to have the hoax sleeve on my 19X, but I recently removed it because I do like having a better grip on that 19X. The hoax sleeve kind of makes it a little fat. But that 17 frame, it feels nice. So for right now, I'm running no hoax sleeve and I have a cut beaver tail. So I don't get slide by. I get that nice firm grip as high as possible on the um, cusp of my hand, whatever they call this, the web of my hand. You feel what I'm saying? So I get the most accurate and precise shots. But, um... You know, 19X is my favorite Glock, so I'm going to go ahead and give this a smooth 8 out of 10. Um, I would prefer just to change that old light out for the Bald R Mini. Other than that, it's clean, it's clean. So, I get that an 8 out of 10. Next up, my boy got the FN 509C. Now, this just looked like a, a variant of the 19X. This looked like a, a peanut butter crunch bar. Um, no upgrades. I never shot no FN, so I can't really speak too much on it, but um, front and back serrations. Looks like it got great texturing all around. Um, magazine look nice. Can't say nothing bad about it. Um, I'll probably give it like a, just a, a 7 out of 10 because it's just plain and basic, but it do got that nice tan color on it, so I get like a 7 out of 10, bro. What y'all think about FNs? Comment down below. Let me know some. And lastly, this is all from the same person. He got an ARP. What he got in the magazine? It say, get Mick F'd. McDonald's Magazine Reference. Okay. Mick. Mm-hmm. Can't say that word. They're going to demonetize my video. But this thing is hard. Hold on. I've been thinking about copying an ARP soon. Because y'all know... For the 2023, I haven't bought any new firearms, so y'all comment down below what I should upgrade my collection with this year. We have the AR, we have three Glocks, we gotta get a Drake, an AK, 
I might get a sniper or something. I definitely got to get an AR-12 gauge and then maybe start diversing the handguns up a little bit. You feel what I'm saying? Maybe, just maybe. Y'all know I love them Glocks, but just maybe. And the ARP too. We have to cop an ARP. Um, Everything looks great on this. Do you have a flashlight? It looks like you got a pressure pad up top. Maybe there's a flashlight on the other side. I can't tell. Um, the magazine customized. I like that. Nice optic. Um, still got the irons. That's great. I need to put some iron sights on my D. Um, this thing looks amazing. I'm not gonna lie. I get that like a, a nine out of ten. I like it. Um, it's fire. It's fire. Yo, I just got a notification from Amazon. If y'all know that I stream on Twitch. Y'all know that I be having some lit live streams. If y'all don't follow me on Twitch, man, go follow my Twitch, Eastside Givens, E S A I Givens. I just got a notification that my Wii will be arriving tomorrow. Y'all know what the Wii is? The little Wii remote. You go bowling, go golfing, you play basketball, you box. The Wii, yes. Tell him stop playing with me. I ordered a Wii, so I will be live streaming playing the Wii. So that's going to be very entertaining. If y'all want to see that, make sure y'all uh, go follow my Twitch because I can't wait till my Wii get here. I'm going to have a PS4 and a Wii and a PC. Schlitty. All right, next up, my boy got the Glock 380. My boy got the 42. Okay, okay. So I do have the 42 Airsoft gun, the world's smallest. Did he put a hog sleeve on that? My boy got a hog sleeve on that 42. That might be fire. I'm not going to lie. I don't even know if I could fit my hand on the hog sleeve. Why he flagging us though? Like, damn, my boy. Showing us the whole burrow. Like, deep in the burrow. One in the chamber. One in the head. Leave him dead. Hog sleeve on a 42 might be fire though. I think it is fire. That's That's tough. I like it. There's no need for any attachments. Maybe just a, a trigger change, but he got the um, custom slide plate on the back that say 380. The irons are clean. Hold sleeve. I get this thing like it's basically a perfect build, bro. Maybe a little Cerakote, but if like I, I said this before in a previous video, if it wasn't for YouTube, bro, I would not be Cerakoting my guns. Like Hustle came over. Y'all gonna see this on Friday. The next video I drop will be a copper drop video with my whole entire gun collection. And he was like, for some of the guns that I have, they're not Cerakoted. It's just a standard gun. He was like, where's the, where's the flavor? He said, you got the bread and the butter. Some people got the bread, but not the butter. Like, sometimes, bro, it's just good to have an all-black firearm. That's what my 43X was supposed to be. But, you know, since I do YouTube, I had, the, I had felt the need to upgrade my gun, so that's why I did this customization. Other than the Hoag sleeve, I would not have done anything to this if I wasn't a YouTuber. I would just have my 43X blacked out. Maybe I would have had that custom slide plate on the back for the Raiders, but other than that, like, I'm not getting no paint jobs on my guns. My gun's not trying to look cute for you, like, but I feel like I have the need to because I gotta step it up. But some of my guns, like my DD, do I gotta go get that thing for y'all? My DD M4V7 is not gonna get no paint job, no Cerakote, no, no sir. You feel what I'm saying? It's gonna stay blacked out, optic, I gotta get the iron sights for it, pressure pad. You feel what I'm saying? Like, I don't need to make this thing look pretty. I think it'll look pretty all black. You feel what I'm saying? So. You know, I would give that um I would give that 42 a 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10. Great firearm, chambered in 380. Got the hoax sleeve on there. It don't get much better than that, man. Don't get much better. Next up, my boy got the Glock 45. But hold on. He told me that this is the Glock 19 Gen 5 frame with the 45 slide, a Hollison optic. He got the threaded barrel and the Olight bald arm mini. This is an amazing build with the Hulk sleeve. Oh my goodness, bro. This look like an amazing tactical build, bro. A lot of people probably disagree with the Olight, but everything else, fire. 
the finger grooves from the Hulk sleeve, the optic from Hollison. He got um, raised irons. That's not the standard iron sights on the Glock. Then he got the um, threaded barrel. The only thing else that I would say is if he put the plus two extension mag in there on the um, on the 19 frame, you put the plus two. Hey man, that's a fire build. Like 10 out of 10, beautiful. I love it. That's tough. That's real tough. It's real tough. Next up, what is this, bro? My boy running outside, he finna slide on somebody? Am I about to witness like a drive-by or something? A walk down? He said he got a reload. Got to cock it back. That's the 18C. Bro just walked outside in the front yard, shot three times, and ran back in the crib. Full auto. Full auto. Ooh. He didn't want to get in trouble by the neighbors. Bro ran back inside quick. I feel it. That's the 18C though. It look real clean. Look like you taking care of it. You feel what I'm saying? My boy in the trenches, man. He can't stay outside too long with that. Oh, he got another video. WI protection. WI protection. Yo, is he hitting the Dougie while he's shooting? What in the light scan? My boy got the Edgar cut. Oh, he dumping that blick sideways. It looked like he was going like this. Hey. That's how he was shooting the gun. Like, teach me how to Dougie. Teach me, teach me how to Dougie. They added the Dougie back to Fortnite. Best believe I had to cop it. I had some V-Bucks in my account. What you think I was going to do when I seen the Dougie in the item shop? Cop it. What do you mean? Like, what are you talking about? It's no discussion. And make sure I use creator code EGUAP in the item shop. Use creator code EGUAP. I don't even get no money because, like, uh, Epic Games told me every 10,000 V-Bucks spent using my credit code, I think I get, like, a dollar or maybe a cent. Like, bro, I would have to get, like, Mr. Beast to promote my code to make money. I don't even think people probably ninja make money off that creator code Mr. Beast But like me, I haven't seen a penny off creator code. So I don't know y'all But my boy dumping the blick sideways. That's tough. You got the 18c That thing moving that thing moving. I'm not gonna lie like It looked like it's brand new cuz the more you use the 18c the more you know, um wear and tear you put on the gun is gonna start operating slower you have to lube it up and you know the green gas magazine gonna start to leak and you know just over time there's more problems that occur with the gun so it looked like that's kind of relatively new from what i've seen and he's taking care of it so you know make sure you take care of it and it's gonna it's gonna shoot cleanly like that thing busting I give it like I give it a nine out of ten, bro. I love the 18C, so I'm gonna give you a nine out of ten. All right, next up, ew, bro. My boy got the clear mag. You know, first of all, won't trust our lives on them clear mags. Second of all, my boy got the Amazon light. And what happened to the handling, like on the firearm? It looked like you used it as an ashtray or something like it got a burn on it on the side of the frame like it's a burn and what is that what is that slide plate on the back bro and why you got your feet is that your feet in the camera yo like his hairy legs at the bottom of the screen bro like this is just a in the bed bro like I didn't even realize what you was taking a picture on. You're taking a picture on a on a bed, on a mattress, and there's not even a sheet on the mattress. Like I could see the little doo-doo stains on the mattress. This guy is shisty, he's dirty, he's gross, he's grimy, bro. He's in the trenches, no sheets on his mattress, on the ground, no bed spring, no bed frame, laying mattress, straight mattress on the ground, on the carpet, doo-doo stains, no socks, hairy legs. Glock 17, Dookie on the frame, Amazon light, ETS magazine, overfill, the uh, spring is already bent up, it's going to jam up, and you got that busted ass slide plate on the back. This is like, I'm not going to lie, this is like a 4 out of 10, bro. You're disappointing me right now. What is he doing, bro? He doesn't even know what he's doing. Somebody take this man. What what Drake say? Not Drake, my fault. What Dirk said? Dirk said, he just told me a Drake was a freaking Glock. 
Man, take his butt in the house. He don't need to be outside. Like, what are we talking about, bro? All right, next up, we got my boy Cole. All right, Cole's first time shooting a Glock 19. Cole's first time shooting a Glock 19. Let's see it, Cole. Eye protection, ear protection. Ooh. Ooh, Cole cannot handle that recoil. You gotta loosen them elbows a little bit, player boy. All right, Cole, bust some Cole. Bust at the ops. Let me see some full auto. Let me see some semi spam that. Let me see that trigger finger. There we go, Cole, picking up the speed. All right, Cole, so I'm not gonna lie, bro. It looked like that Glock is knocking you back a little bit. You might gotta do some push ups. You feel what I'm saying? Look at that. Boom. You see them triceps? Boom. Cole, I know what you need, man. Go subscribe to Guap Gains on YouTube. I just started a new YouTube channel called Guap Gains where I'm going to be posting everything health and fitness related. I'm going to be showing y'all how I work out, giving y'all tips and tricks, the best workouts for what goals you want to achieve. If you want to get big and strong and you want to lift a lot of weight on your bench press or if you want to get cut and fit and get some abs. I just got a four pack right now. I'm gonna get the um the rest later. I'm not trying to sell y'all no course. Like I'm not selling y'all nothing. This is just a fitness channel where I'm going to be posting all of my personal workouts, answering any questions y'all have, and showing y'all the proper form on all exercises. So if y'all are interested in fitness and improving your health and your strength, then go ahead and subscribe to Guap Gains. Also. I know everybody likes to talk about money, you feel what I'm saying? Everybody likes to get money, show money, you feel me? That's what the guap gang's all about. We're about getting that guap, man. But are y'all being smart with y'all money? Are y'all letting y'all money work for yourself? You feel what I'm saying? Your money should be working for your money to make more money. So I also started a new channel, Guap Financial, where I'm gonna be telling y'all the best things to invest on, where to put your money, high yield savings accounts to get into such as apple cit bank like teaching y'all game bro like as much as i know i'm still learning but i want to tell y'all what to do because you feel me like it's enough money out there for all of us like you got to be smart with your money i don't want y'all to be broke i'm gonna be giving y'all advice and what to do like more about um the economy because when i was in school i took a class like What's that class called? Econ? I took an econ class, but the class got cut short because of COVID. So everything that I know about my financial literacy, I learned on YouTube and I want to regurgitate that to y'all. So you feel me? It's more to me than just guns. It's more to me than just guns, y'all. I want to show y'all the financial channel and give y'all a game about how to make money and make your money work for you. And I also created a new channel, Guap Games, where I'm going to show y'all how I work out and how I stay fit, man. So make sure y'all tap in, subscribe to all my channels. Um, I want to thank you guys so much for 700,000 subscribers. I know we're almost at 800,000 now. We're growing extremely fast. We're on the rate to hit 1 million subscribers this year, which still blows my mind to this day. Like, I would never imagine a million subscribers this soon, even ever. Like, it's always been a goal of mine to do YouTube and, you know, get the plaques and stuff like that. But a million subscribers, I never knew if, like, I was ever going to achieve that. And right now, it's looking very possible. And it's looking like we will hit that this year. So, thank you from the bottom of my heart to everybody in the Guap gang. Uh, make sure y'all subscribe to all the channels, man. Smash the like button. Stay tuned for a new video dropping this Friday. It's a banger with GSG Hustle. Copper dropped my whole entire gun collection. Y'all just got to stay tuned. This summer, we're going up, man. So, Appreciate y'all. Go out getting on top. I'm going to catch y'all in my next video, man.